Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a face paint of Black Panther uh, from the new movie Civil War, Captain America. And these are the materials that we're going to be using in today's video. You can also see a list in my description box below. And this is what the finished product looks like guys. Um, I really wanted to attempt this. I think Black Panther looks really cool in the upcoming movie Civil War. So the first thing I'm actually going to start with is some Black Paradise paint and a number 4 brush. And what I'm going to pretty much do is outline the profile here of Black Panther's face. Um, I am actually using a picture reference um, to do this. And what I'm making sure that I do, when I work on my left side, I'm working on my right side immediately. Uh, that way I can just get everything symmetrical. Now I did go a little bit higher there on that line, uh, so the top line on the forehead you just can, you can just ignore and I'm just going to wipe that out later. Um, but I'm pretty much pleased the way this profile is coming out so far. And what I'm making sure I'm doing is just I don't have too much paint on my brush when I'm doing this. And I noticed on this mask there is some really cool shapes. Um, I'm going to do my best to get as much in as I can. And next I'm going to use some grey paradise paint. Because um, even though Black Panther's mask is black, um, I'm actually going to use a lot of grey, black and white. Uh, that way I can get the contrast and make it look 3D. And for this I'm actually using a 3 quarter inch Meron flat brush. Now I'm pretty much going to cover a lot of this with the light grey and then I'm going to mix a little bit of black and just do this on the side areas. But I'm trying my best to not go over the black lines, um, that way I still have these really cool shapes and I don't lose them. And next I'm going to come in with a number 4 brush and I'm just going to fill in the small areas that I couldn't fit with my uh, big brush. And what I'm doing, I'm mixing some white, and black and grey, just to get the desired highlights and contrast that I need. And then I'm going to repeat the same here on the other side. And then I'm just going to come in and darken the areas here, just and then a little bit of black to the grey. And then with some black Meron powder and a smoothie blender, I'm going to black out my eyes. And what I'm also going to do is paint my eyes white um, when they're closed, uh, just so they kind of look pretty cool, just like the Black Panther's eyes. And now I'm going to add some highlights here where I think I need it with some white. And I'm just going to add some soft highlights here.
And as you can see, what I did, I actually whitened out my eyes um, when they were closed. And then once the paint's dry, I'm gonna come in with a number two brush and add a little bit more white where I think I need it. I'm just going to highlight add some highlights here on the top of the ears because uh, what I'm giving the illusion is just like the light is actually reflecting down on top of the mask. And this is what the finished product looks like guys. Um, I actually blacked out the rest of the image. I think this makes a really cool face paint for Halloween or cosplay. So please like, share and subscribe to our channel and we'll see you real soon.